my god, really? This sucks so bad. How the hell did Jax get taken out in like four turns? That is so stupid. Yeah. Wow. Wow! Alright. So, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna nuke the Croc Rock. That comes out. This should see a kill. So I'm hoping it doesn't click fake out turn one. Face or um, calm mind turn one. I mean. Okay, that's a little unfortunate, but we can kind of deal with it. Um, so I'm gonna start confiding. Okay. There's the light screen. So, Swoobat is currently at plus zero, plus two. Air Slash. It's now at minus two, plus two. Torment on me. Minus four, plus two. I am tormented now, so I can't really do anything. Um, so I'm just going to faint attack here. It's not attacking anymore. Okay. I'm a little weirded out by how this never tried to burn me again. Um... Because that puts me in a really weird spot now. Um... Where I'm, like, super in danger from Sableye, so I kind of have to switch. Um, so the safe play is probably back to Ribombi, right? Okay, yeah. Uh, I'm risking, I'm risking crits now, though. Um, so we're gonna struggle bug here. Okay, it's at plus two plus, or no, it's at minus two plus four. It's not minus four plus four. That should kill it. It's so close. Okay. Um. Okay. Um. It doesn't matter. This struggle bug will finish it off. I cure that with my Rossberry. Just don't crit me. Okay, we're good. I'm gonna have to take the burn, unfortunately. Cacnea goes down. Draining kiss. Hitmonchan, okay. Um. I should be able to just finish the fight from here. Um, because Ribombi is specifically EV'd, um, for Spatic and Speed. Oh, Hitmonchan, um, does have Fake Out, though. But I'm not in range of Fake Out. And it knows that I, it can't flinch me with it. Um, 
So I think I just Moonblast it. Yeah. It was trying to Ice Punch either me or Golit. Um... So the question then is, am I in range of Shiftry's fake out? And the answer to that is mm, sometimes. Um, so that's like never worth risking. We're going straight into Pelipper. Okay, it went for Heat Wave instead, so I would have been fine. Um, but you know, at this point, it's better to just play it safe. Okay, that goes down, and big, huge damage there. And we finish it off. Okay. <sighs> Deathless tag. Whoo! I'm. Okay, okay, this is actually the best thing we could have asked for. This is what I've been wanting every single run. Okay, so let's see what Vega decides to do today. So we're gonna start by clicking work up, and they're immediately gonna withdraw into Spirit Tomb. Um, kind of awkward, but I can ab absolutely play around that. Um, by just switching straight into Houndoom. I don't think there's any reason to, like, have Clefable get burned, because I'm not gonna two-shot it at plus one. Okay, so we got flash fired. Um, Firefang's gonna do a pretty big chunk now. Nice. Um, and now punishment will probably start to do more than that, right? Um, like, so this is flash fired, but this is now at plus one, plus one, meaning punishment and fire fang are actually doing the same amount right now. So I'm just gonna go for another fire fang. Big flinch. It's fine. Okay, now it's at plus two, plus two. So see, now, I'm pretty sure this is like guaranteed to die to punishment this turn. Almost. Um, we're just gonna punishment again. Get rid of Spirit Tomb. That's one down. Okay, Absol comes in. I am in range of some play rough rolls and all close combat rolls. It doesn't really matter either way. The correct play is just switch straight into Ribombi. Who tanks both fairly easily. I don't know why Ribombi's EVs aren't in the calc. Um, but Ribombi is definitely EV. Hi, Charlie. How you doing? Yeah, so Ravambi takes both of these attacks perfectly well. That's pretty much all it can go for. I guess it could theoretically go for knockoff. We take knockoff fine too. We swap in. We kill it with Moonblast. Okay, close combat. Best case scenario, that does the least amount of damage. Okay, there's the negative emotions proc. And now we outspeed in one shot. Beautiful. That crit didn't matter. 
minimum roll was 105%. Okay, there's negative emotions proc. Ponyard comes in. This is perfectly expected. Ponyard is always going to go for Iron Head here. Um, so proud of you. Um, yeah, Ponyard's always going to be clicking Iron Head here. So the question is... Is Houndoom better? Or is... Litleo better. I think the answer is Litleo. Oh god! Okay, wait, that's that's kind of fine actually. We outspeed it. We outspeed it. Flare Blitz is a one shot, guaranteed. Awesome. Okay. So far, so good. It's three down. Haunch comes in. And now we go back into Clefable and finish it off. And soft boiled. There's one. He can't do anything now. We win. We're at plus two. Yeah. Okay, that crit sucks. Um, okay, did you already get it done? Those crits, dude! Stop it! Ah! Okay, I'll I'll still be ending as soon as I finish this fight. So I'll meet you. Okay, at plus three, we should kill this, right? Yeah. Okay, see you in a bit. And Liveheart comes in. I'm gonna soft boiled. Disarming Cry is gonna proc Sash. And we finish the fight. Deathless Vega, let's go. GG's. if I need them. Okay. How's the damage here? Pretty damn good. Okay. Yeah. There's my prism. I was 
really like to... I mean, yeah, that doesn't matter, huh? Because that's always going to go here. Um, I'm already confused, actually, so this is going to click... Um, this is going to click Toxic, huh? That's a little more annoying. But I don't really have anything to do against it. Good damage. Frostbite! Nice! Let's go. Okay, and now we're gonna switch here. That's gonna do nothing to me. And yeah, one down. This is probably Zam. I guess it could be back into Mizzy. If I could. Perfect. <sighs> Bad move, buddy. Get out of here. Right, I did forget about the sash, huh? Uh, oops. And Sucker Punch isn't gonna work. I mean, okay, wait. Serious talk time. How much of an asshole do I want to be here? That's what I was thinking, yeah. Cause like, knock towel, level 32. Max Spadef. Like, that's probably my best play here. Oh, I guess I could have attacked there, huh? Um, but now it's at minus one spadic. Um, I'm never in kill range of either. Uh, I was not supposed to be in kill range of that. Nope, I was incorrect. I, I was completely incorrect. Actually hard punished. Actually punished, I calc wrong. I should have always just taken the switch there. Okay, Mizzy comes out, and now we win. Yeah, it's not that bad. Okay. That's half the fight. Okay. You just have to hope not to flinch. Need to dodge a single flinch. Come on, buddy. Four out of five times is fine. Don't do it. Nice. Bit of an unnecessary loss there with Noctowl. Ah! 
I forgot about Picky Peck having bullet seed. the Intimidate. First turn, we're clicking Whirlpool. Okay, the miss is annoying. Don't switch. Okay, good. Got it. One down. This should bring in Dodrio. Good. This is always going to click Brave Bird. I'm not in range of anything else. So I didn't mean to click out there. This is Choice Banded. a lot of damage. Alright. I've got the stealth rocks. Really? Wow. Very interesting. Huh. Okay, wait. I'm never in range. Bro, literally stop. Okay. That's really awkward. <sighs> like, I don't really have a lot I can switch in on it. Like... Don Fan can take it, but not well. Gera Gera's a bad play. No, Gera's a Gera's a terrible play. Um, the Intim would happen, but remember we're taking Stealth Rocks damage. Um Yeah, rocks are still up. Um Rocks are now up on both sides. It would be, after the Intimidate, it would be 48 to 57% with Brave Bird. Um, um, so, uh, there's like a theoretical chance I live it. I don't know if it's worth it. I don't want to have to just sat Gigalith though, right? Like that seems kind of bad. But rocks are gonna do 25%. 25% of Gyarados' HP is 33. So we would be. It would be 33 minus 101, which would be 71, Meaning we would actually be in most Brave Bird kill ranges. I think I have to go Dawn Fan, huh? This is incredibly off script. But I, I don't think I have another play. Well, wait, wait, wait. How much HP is it at? If I switch into Dawn Fan, will it die to recoil? It might. I have 
to do that. I think that's my only way. It's either that or sack Gigalith, and I don't have another good rock type since Golem died. I'm actually getting so punished for that fucking Golem death now, because that'd be such an easy switch. <sighs> Fuck, okay. Alright, Gonfen! Dodrio's down, that's okay. What's what's coming out? Crobat. Is I'm probably in kill range, right? Um No, actually, never. Um Can't rolling this. Got rid of the rocks. This is now at plus two spatic, which is scary as fuck. Um... How does Crobat handle it? Not terribly, actually. Um... This is really fucking annoying. We have to go into this, then. Sludge Bomb, best case scenario. It's the least amount of damage it can do to me. Um, we kind of have to click Zen Headbutt here. I don't know how the fuck we outsped. Um, I'll take it, though. We shouldn't be speed tied. I... I did I screw up? Oh, I screwed up. Oh, I screwed up badly and didn't get punished. I didn't EV. I didn't EV myself correctly. I still have 252 speed EVs instead of my static focus. Win the speed tie again? Oh, it'd be really funny. Just live. No flinch? Thank you. Cool. That's three down. Never punished. Okay, um, this is probably Gliscor. Okay, good. Um, this can only ever be Rock Tomb. <sighs> this can't toxic me, so it's either it's either Rock Tomb or Protect. It's, it should always be Rock Tomb here. Um, we're gonna go Sunflora. Where is it? 